Today we are sticking the world's smallest action camera, the Insta360 Go 2, inside of a foosball table to create some epic B-roll. So the first shot is going to be Ali putting the ball in and it's gonna roll to about halfway across the field. And then I'm going to take the first shot with this black team and the ball will go past the camera and that will be shot one. We're shooting on manual with a go to and we have our ISO set at 100. I might bump that up to 200 depending on how the first couple shots go, but I really hope to not go higher than 200 on the ISO. We are shooting at 4K at 50 frames a second, and obviously the aspect ratio is going to be nine by 16 because this is for an Instagram reel. So we're shooting this all vertically, and we are shooting on the linear field of view, and we are shooting with log profile on. Okay, so I just got some regular old duct tape, and for this second shot, I just wanna attach the camera upside down to the player, just like that and make sure it doesn't scrape and we're good so for this second shot we are going to have the ball be hitting off the black team and then it's just going to go hit the insta 360 go to right in the front of the camo so to create a little movement in the shot i'm going to have my player start over here and then just pull it over just like that for shot three it's going to be very similar to shot two and i'm just going to move this guy over to this side. So this is going to allow us to film this at a really unique angle. We're gonna place the ball right here. He comes all the way back and then goes for the shot. So we're gonna hit the ball kind of delicately and just hit it nice and easy instead of trying to hit it hard as you actually would. So this is where it's gonna get fun. Shot four, we're using a tape measure to get a really quick, fun, creative shot. So if you're not aware, the Insta360 Go 2 is actually magnetic. So you can attach it to things like tape measures. So we're gonna kind of sneak it through here, creating a tunnel in between the players. Hopefully the ball and the tape measure falling back like this go at roughly the same exact speed. So the Go 2 is able to track the ball and it looks nice and cinematic. It's probably gonna be a little bit more difficult than I'm expecting, so let's go ahead and get started. Whew. Okay guys, so final last shot of this video. We're almost there. This is gonna be one of the easiest shots of the whole video, and we are just gonna have one person roll the ball in like that, and then I'm gonna just kind of move my hand just a little bit. I think I'm gonna flick this goalie as well so it doesn't look like no one's playing the game. It'll still look like someone's trying to defend and that'll be the end of the video. So let's go ahead and get that shot and wrap this thing up. And that is a wrap on the video. I'm so stoked with the way this is turning out. So here's the moment you guys have all been waiting for, the final results to the foosball table video. Hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.